the first job of this, well, I've already been here before. I rearranged all the Christmas trees because we're at our Christmas tree farm. We have a lot of them. Well, maybe not a lot, but for us it's a lot. But we rearranged them yesterday and so that there's more airflow, especially between these because these, these were like six rows. Now they're four. So they have a little bit more space around them for wind flow and also growth. But now the remaining job is weeding. It's not that bad. I see a couple of weeds over there. And also on the plastic. So let's get this done, shall we? It doesn't look like much, but it is looking a lot better than before. Here's the proof. All the weeds. So this is a 10 liter bucket. So I'm guessing like three, three and a half full buckets of weeds. One thing less to do. Next up on the agenda is planting this uh, red bud, I believe. Well, oh, there's the tag. Forest pansy. So according to this tag, it grows two and a half meters tall, which I don't think is the truth, but well, we shall see. But it has, oh, you know, beautiful dark red colored leaves with a hint of green depending on and the younger the leaf the redder it is but it's gorgeous so we'll add some red to the garden also some spring color because no it flowers according to this tag in what's this april may time but all over the stem, but just like the other um, red bud we have, but that has a green leaf, this has something extra. So yeah, let's find the spot for it. The first option. <laughs> it doesn't like its spot, no. It's like, no, I don't want to be planted here. Well, it's in this corner with the big magnolia. We do miss red in this corner, so it is a possibility. But yeah, we also have a different spot in mind. Something smells nice here. Yeah, I mag naar die. Oh, <laughs> je neemt de pot niet mee. Ah, je moet wel water hebben. Ja, dat zeg ik. Je neemt de pot niet mee. Of... 
or there. So the other red is that um, ornamental cherry. Yes, ornamental cherry. But to bring a little bit more red into here is also nice. So we have that spot as an option or over there. Hmm. Let us discuss and contemplate and we'll get to planting. As you can see, the red bud forest pansy ended up over there. In the end, that felt like the best spot, so we went with that. And we can add something else red on the other side or on the other spot. But what I also wanted to show you was, while we got the forest pansy, we also got, well, a lot of other plants like some geraniums this is a eupatorium I'm not sure what the English name of this is this is an erigeron um, no cannot think of it this is a oregonum. This is a jeez. I just heard it, but I'm not sure anymore. Anyways, a variety of plants. And there's another bunch over here. These are some asters. These are some asters, this and this. Some creeping, creeping. Also cannot think of the name, but creeping something. Maybe if you see the flowers, you know what, the, what it is. I will also put the name on the screen, but I just cannot think of it. We got three, 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 three tree peonies. So a dark purple one, um, a light pink, and a brighter pink, and a agapanthus. That's that one, and. Those are the highlights, I would say. Well, yeah. A nice collection to add to the garden and then think, did we add anything at all? Well, we did, but I'm happy with this selection. Maybe I will plant a couple of them now or maybe tomorrow, or I at least want to get them in the ground as soon as possible because they're better off in the ground than they are here and especially especially because they are in such well they're tiny pots not that that's bad but huh? that just means giving them water is difficult so yeah also there are a whole lot of ants all over the place. We are going to do an evening planting session because it is a quarter to nine, but we are like, yeah. And it's going to be these, these apparently Japanese th three peonies that. Oh, well, have a tag and a thingy. Oh, uh, well. Doing this one-handed. Mm. 
not the best. But oh, this is the back side of the tag. It says it grows to about a meter. Flowers in May, June. Prune after, well, after flowering then basically. If it will focus or not. Um, yeah. Oh. So now we just find, need to find three spots where these big dudes can grow. Or not, but because they all get a meter, I think. Yes. Well, they could probably grow bigger, but hemp yep. pruning. And since we did plant our red bud over there, the other spot that we had is available for something big. So I was thinking a tree peony. And yeah, maybe we'll have to see what we can think of. So one can go over there to fill up this area and Yeah. Two more. That need a place or a home or something. Maybe on the corner here. Because why not? But then it's, well, it's in keeping with Peony Lane. Because there are three already here. One, two, three. And yeah, we'll have to think about the third one. We are on the move. 